everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I have a very exciting video because I have a hen party haul. If you saw my Poundland haul that I did a couple of weeks ago then you'll know that I have my friend's hen party that I'm planning. The actual party is tomorrow so I'm going to be filming it today just because I need to set everything up. Um, I do have a couple of things that are missing that I still haven't got in the post and fingers crossed I will get them tomorrow but they are these banners which I will insert a clip of if they turn up and also these balloons. So everything else I've popped into this bag which is the one that I use for my Powerland haul. I'm going to start off with the things that I got for the hens and the bride's goodie bags. I showed these in the Powerland haul. You can see I have already used them but they are just these cute little woolly straws and I'm going to be giving everyone one of each colour because you get 10 in a pack, 5 of each, so it's the perfect amount because there's 5 of us. I then also got these off of eBay, hopefully you can see what these are, but these came 12 for, I want to say like £2 or something, really cheap, but these are just these really cute little willy straws which I thought would be funny, and I have enough for all of the hens and the bride to have one each, and I also have some left over which is going to be great because afterwards we have some other friends coming round um, to celebrate as well, so they can all have one too. I then have these badges, these are the bride squad ones and there's also a bride to be one but I'm not going to be using that as you can see I've started putting these into the little goodie bags for the hens. Then I got these as well from eBay. These are little hen party shot glass necklaces. I take this one out of the bag because this one is spare. So this is just what the actual shot glass looks like. The back is plain and then it comes on this beaded necklace chain. I also picked up a load of glow sticks for the bags and I'm also going to pop these on the table if anyone wants these too. These are for the big reveal because this is a surprise so I've got these all in the hens bags and I've also got them on the table for when she comes in. I then have two of these shots in each of the hen and the bride's bags. These are just the different flavours that there are so there is sour apple, berry sour, cherry sour and cola cube so i have two of two of these in each of the bags including the brides these are the bags that i got for the hens so this is just a six pack that i got from poundland i only need four of these so i have two spare but they're just a hot pink and they say bride squad on them in white then for the bride's bag i have a different and larger bag because i have more things for her hopefully you can see this but it just says it says bride to be on the front of it and this is a more of a light pastel pink which i thought was really pretty um i got this from ebay but this was quite expensive um i will link everything in the description box down below but i think this was like two pound fifty just for this one paper bag i then have a couple of like dress up things for her to wear that are all from poundland so i have the garter a rosette badge and then a little veil and then i also have this sash which says uh bride to be on it and i also got this from ebay as well i'm not going to get it out because obviously i'm going to pop this in her bag so then for table decorations i just have this light pink tablecloth this is from asda i then have two different plates so i have these like copper rose gold ones that are just plain and circular from Asda. And then I have these ones which are hexagon and they're white with the copper rose gold spots and trimming. Then I found these napkins from Asda which were pretty much perfect to go with it as well. And then the cups don't match but they say bride squad on them. These are from Home Bargains and it's the only bride squad thing that I could find. They didn't have the napkins or plates which is why i ended up with the ones that i have but i still really liked these so i got them anyway for normal decorations i have these make your own tassel garlands and these are in pink copper and white so as i said i have two of those then i have this little party balloon bunting and i also have one that says love and then I found this in Aldi. They 
had all of their hen stuff on clearance and I found this I only had one of it left but it says bride to be so if my bun if my banners don't turn up at least I have one this was reduced to £1.50 I think and I also have this tape so this is just like caution tape but a hen party one and I found this in a little party shop in my nearest town centre the last thing that I have is confetti these are just little hearts and then it has the learning plates on them and these are from card factory i then have some party props i have this big set from poundland and it just has loads of different things hopefully you can see and this is just going to be perfect for the backdrop that i got i also found this balloon photo frame which i thought was pretty cool and it matched the colors that we're going for so i got one of those and this one also which is a ring both of these two are from home bargains and then i picked up a silly one which is just this guitar from Palan and it's bright pink the next thing that i have is probably just going to be for photos but people can also wear this out if they want to so i have this make your own sash that i thought maybe her sister might want to wear or someone else can wear it if they really want to and this one is just a hot pink and from poundland and then i have these two little head boppers so this is the first one and it just says hen party on it and i really like this one i think i might wear this one because it's really cute and then of course we got the willy one as well so someone can wear these out if they want to or they're just fun to take photos in the very last thing that i have um is just this game it's just it has willy stickers and it's a poster and it's like pin the tail on the donkey but you're pinning a different kind of tail on a man so this is also from the party shop near my house also but yeah that is everything that i have for the hem party i think i'm going to vlog like setting up and things but i doubt that i'll vlog the actual night just because of privacy reasons for my bride um but i'm really really excited for this i'm super excited to see her face because she literally has no idea that i'm doing this and yeah i'm just really excited and i can't wait to set it all up and just for her to see everything i have like a whole ton of food but i've brought that i'm going to be setting up with my lovely mum's help um i'm not the best cook so she's going to help me out and yeah i'll probably vlog all of that like i said but then once my friends turn up i'll probably shut the cameras off but if you want to see that i will leave the vlog channel and the video down below when it goes up but thank you so much for watching if you like this video please do subscribe and give it a thumbs up i will pop in the description as well the poundland haul that i did last week because i also had some hen stuff in there that i haven't included in this video but thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next one bye guys the seasons come and go like thoughts of you like a wave returns to the sea into the blue